What's up, y'all? It's Kill. It's Duop. TD. And you watching, watching the debut. Iceberg, where the fuck you been? Well, I already know where I've been. Working my move with my folk and my kin. When I go, I go all the way in. I used to be broke, now I'm all the way fixed. I don't wanna talk if it ain't about millions. Walk so many miles, not riding a Bentley. Gotta stay down on your grind and you get it. So many motherfuckers then burn their bridge. I don't even. Alright, we from Greenville, Mississippi, and I'm the co owner of Undecided Urban Gear. And I'm the owner of Star Child. I'm the owner of Undecided Urban Gear. I go to MDCC and I major in business man technology. I'm at Kahoma. Both of us at yeah. Kahoma. And my major is agricultural science. My major also agricultural science. But I want to major in fashion and fruition. Um, I think me and do I make ten grade? You know, ten grade? Yeah. It yeah, was make ten grade like every day. It was like every day, like middle of the day. And we was asked who like how much. Yeah, you sold? we used to meet each other in the bathroom, yeah. like unexpected. Like we would just be selling snacks and we'd be in the bathroom like almost every day. Yep. And we ask each other, it would be like you sold out, like making small talk like every day, and then we just got cool. Then next semester, we, we got the same class. Yeah. It was on theater. Uh, theater, yeah, yeah. We theater. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do no work in that bitch. Since then, man, it's my for life. Okay. And oh, uh, I forgot how I met you. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Oh, we met through um, Feel Great. Whatever yeah. Feel Great. The Death Dream. Death Dream yeah. Chill. We went to watch it. Kobe yeah. and Memphis Grizzly. Like, Kobe, Kobe Lakers. Yeah, like Kobe, Kobe, Kobe team. <laughs> Fuck it. Cold <laughs> To be honest, for fun, we don't really we don't really do nothing to be honest. Like every day we ride around, chill out, chill with each, chill with each other, vibe out, yeah. play the game together. We take troops most of the time. Well not I ain't gonna say most of the time, but we take troops like sometimes just to get away from Greenville. Yeah, like every three months, something like yeah, that. Yeah, ain't really nothing in Greenville to do to be honest. So yeah. We try to get away when we can. I mean, other than that, school. Um, yeah, that's really it. Yeah. To be honest, we listen to all different types of music. I listen to like King's Leon, Kanye. Uh, what's her name? Janice. Janice Joplin. Yeah, she her. Hard. Like, rap. Uh, Rallo. Rock. No pop. cap. No, yeah, yeah, no cap. Rallo. No more, like, more, all them type. Like, I, I, so listen, Fago. I listen to gospel music too. Yeah, so Fago, him. Yeah. He wanna. I listen to Uzi. Yeah. yeah. He just can't, it's just something you just can't. Just, yes. All you just gotta, you know. Like a lot of shit, a lot of different shit. I'm gonna say snakes, bro. I hate snakes, bro. Snakes scary, bro. Snakes. bro. Like, uh, bro, snakes vary from different sizes, bro. What's your biggest fit though? Yeah, yeah, Out of yeah. everything, your biggest fit. Like. Snakes, nigga. Right, bro, you ain't scared of snake, bro. I mean, I'm scared of being, but ain't my biggest fit though. My biggest fit for real. I say, my big fit getting buried alive, boy. Mm, come on now, that's good. My shit so is like buried alive, bro. Shit. You know when they gonna let you out? Yeah, dry the kind of thing. 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 I don't want to say my biggest fear though. You already yeah. in that bitch. Now nah, you already in that bitch. Yeah, you already <laughs> fear for your life. You already in that flame. Man, hey, well, yeah, I'm going to stick with snakes. I'm yeah, stick snake. With snakes. Let's go. My shit drowned. And hey, my shit buried alive. I'm scared of heights too though. I don't even fuck with heights. I don't even rock with heights like that. Yeah. I say when I was young, I was scared of Freddy Krueger and 18 Wheels. My cat Freddy Krueger. Hey, nigga, scared to go to sleep. No Why <laughs> 18 Wheels though? The bitch was loud. Like, yeah, it'd be big as a motherfucker. I see, I see, I see. I fuck with it. If I go back five years old, what would I do? i invest all my money in crypto. Every single dime I get, no more toys, no more nothing. <laughs> Just put all that money in crypto. Man, I'd really? be the smartest nigga alive, bro. No Straight A's in school. A's. I'm talking about, man, I'm, I'm probably going to skip almost every grade. Okay. I'm be like a Albert Einstein Jr. <laughs> in real life. <laughs> For real, though. I just mean. prevent certain shit from happening. Yeah, yeah. that too. I'm, I'm gonna have all the girls because I'm gonna have all the game. I'm gonna know how to get every girl I want. I'm gonna be the freshest nigga around. Man, I'm be gonna on know, trend before I'm, it even I'm, happens. I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna know the latest trend. <laughs> then you can make the movie before it even happens too. The OB. I'll probably be famous. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Something that I was scared of that I'm not scared of anymore. I probably say girls in real life, boy, because back then I used to be so scared. Like, Man, yeah, I used to be scared. <laughs> I say, shit, needles. Boy, I couldn't take a needle for shit. They had the time I had down to take one for okay. real. Well, especially in the booty, but. Ooh, <laughs> 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 
Yeah, yeah, I ain't nobody scared. Ain't no yeah. job. <laughs> I remember one time Spider bit me in the head, cuz. And Jake Mike with a big ass needle, for real. I was, if I had to describe myself one sentence, I'd say the quietest person in the room, but the most outspoken. I say I'm humble and down to earth. Um, and I say I'm the most versatile and I'm fearless, cuz I really, I never cared about an opinion. If I could change one thing about the world, I simply say racism. When I say the pottery rate, there's too many people struggling for real. I say gang violence and black on black crime. What inspired me to start a clothing brand? Um, I just felt as if I had the vision and like I knew about fashion already, so I just felt as if I could start my own instead of buying other people's stuff. What inspired my brand was Instagram. I just saw so many people selling and I thought I could add my artistic flair to it and sell people something different. To be honest, our name really was a mutual decision. Like, me and him came together and got the name. Um, at first, he sent me this this little symbol and was like, we could start a brand. And we were thinking of names. And I was like, mixed emotions. Like, it sat for a little minute, marinated a little bit. And it wasn't really what we wanted. So a couple days later, he sent me a text and he was like, undecided urban gear. And then I undecided. It like stuck because if you look at the symbol, like you don't really know which movie you're gonna be in in that day. So I was just like, yeah, like I'm rocking with it. And what inspired my clothing brand was a Kings Leon song, Stormy Weather. And he said something about Star Child, and I feel like that was a good name to stick with and roll with to start my clothing brand. Fashion to me is just basically how you express yourself as a person. And I agree with that, but I like to add on, I say, fashion to me is just a way you can show your artistic flair. So the question was, who we make clothes for? Grandma, your sister, your brother, your auntie, your other grandma, your uh, daddy. Uncle, everybody. Everybody. Everybody can get it, for real. I just felt as if the world should see my inside, like, like what I do in real life. Because a lot of people say, I'm funny, and me and my homeboy is funny. And I seen other YouTubers doing it, and I just felt as if I should do that, too. It's free money, so why not? I really got my name from him, to be honest. Like... He had a fresh Instagram name, and it was Ralph Noor. And I wanted to, I, I really took his name for real <laughs> and made it my own. I made, I took the R, I don't know where I get that from, but first start just stuck, and it looked good. To be honest, I really just want to drop some videos. I know, like, every, a lot of people have been telling me to drop, but I don't really be knowing what to do, because, like, if I post it and y'all don't watch it, it's going to be pointless. I really want to get some great content for y'all that I can watch, but it's coming soon. For the future, I just want our brand to be well known. I want to be like on Yeezy level. Like I want to have my own stores, like big websites, like the Instagram page going crazy. I just want to, yeah, to be on for real. Yeah. Y'all can find me at Rough Start on all platforms: Snapchat, R U F S T A R T, my Instagram, The Rough Start. My YouTube, Rockstar TV, and my Facebook is Jaquel Smith. Uh, Y'all can find me on Instagram and Snapchat at TJAustin.1 and Twitter, TJAustin underscore one. And Y'all can find me on Instagram, Ralph North, that's R A F North, and Snapchat, No One Travel, N O dot one Travel. Something I made a long time ago. The money. <laughs> bro, I'm saying, bro, just say what I said, bro. Just say what I said. Like, you gonna be a clip that in? Say what I said, bro. Like, bro. How we met, Tini? I say the beginning of next month, like June third, June fifth, sometime in there, bro. It's like you party, bro. That's the channel. They gonna think it's like party, bro. Oh, God, all right, come on, come on. Fashion. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna be sarcastic and fuck, but oh, I'm gonna, yeah, but that money be our new channel, man. What's that? Our clone brand part of the creativity and uniqueness. It just brings something new to the table. <laughs> 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 uh, that is so funny, I'm cause. gonna catch him out. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh my so god, funny, he gonna get it though. I thought he was going to say awesome. <laughs> Come on, give me it, bro. I was going to say awesome. Bro, <laughs> basically the same thing. Come on, bro.